All right, guys, we're back with some more Sons of the Forest. Thank you again, uh, everybody, for all the love that you guys showed last episode. Had an absolute blast coming back in, checking out the new update. There's a lot of changes, guys. Uh, we've been, you know, traversing the map now is just a cinch. Once you find yourself a glider, you get the little glide platform built up. I actually, if you guys haven't seen last episode, I'll be uh, using that right off the bat here because we've got some exploring that we're going to go do. Try to get some of the uh, the essentials going this episode. I'll start working on the base a little bit this episode and uh, and go from there. But again, thank you guys so much for all of the love, all the support you guys have been showing. Remember, if you are enjoying this and you want to see more, smash that like button, drop a comment down below, consider subscribing to the channel. It means the world to me guys um so let's see where we go um so as you guys know last episode we uh we started just we got a little camp here going nothing nothing crazy nothing super super established yet uh we just literally have a a tent uh we got this log sled going we got some sticks but yeah nothing super super established these damn seagulls have been pecking at my food the whole time it's kind of annoying but uh, it looks like the sun's actually going down here soon. So let me uh, take a swig off this. Now, we might even get winter this episode, you guys. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Um, what does she have? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Look at the little smile, dude. Thank you. All right, let's go ahead and grab our pot here. Uh, now, I do want to go back to that cave that we died in. Last episode, I do want to go back there, try to get that cave cleared, because uh, that's where we'll get the da the scuba tank. That's one of the first caves you need to do. Uh, she's chilling by the fire, guys. Okay, so we'll throw these two pieces of meat in there. Let's get that going. Well, you guys don't have sound, do you? Now you now you should have sound. I turned the sound off initially because the uh, when I when I try to do my intro and the game's just like blah 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 blah. <laughs> I always feel like I'm yelling over it. These damn seagulls, man. There's, I mean, it's not bad because we kind of get like a little seagull farm going here. So it's, it's really not the worst thing being down on the beach. Shut up. And they are kind of loud, though. <clears throat> okay, so food's done. Uh, we'll eat that in the morning. It's past time. Hopefully, we don't get attacked in the middle of the night. Oh, we're good. Don't step in the fire. Okay, so what we're going to do first is we're going to go around, um, we're going to try to hit some of those uh, campsites and get our hands on a few things of cloth because that's really what we need in order to make more armor. Uh, so we're going to go around and do that really quick. That'll be first order of business. Let me see, how many arrows do we got? Okay, we got 12. 3D printed arrows, got crossbow bolts, carbon fiber arrows. All right, we're looking good, guys. We got... Hmm. 
do need to get that filled with fresh water. All right. So here we go, guys. Here we go. We're going to get some elevation. This is one of the new things. You literally get your glider. And one of the changes they made is you can actually put the glider in your inventory now, which is huge uh, because it was super frustrating before. It was like a world object you could have put in your inventory. It was, it was super annoying. But they made it a foldable glider. You can now put it in your inventory. You step up on here and boom. All right. So you start off. Got to gain some speed. Kind of play this game here, gaining elevation slowly but surely, and uh, you can get super, super high in the air. Couple camps here. Mm. I don't know if that will really be worth the cloth. Yeah, my goal is going to be we're going to set some of these uh, catapults up all around the map. Uh, that way we can, no matter where we land, we'll be able to get back up in the air without having to travel super, super far. Okay, so we got three cannibal camps within pretty close within pretty close proximity. Well, four of them. Um, problem is clearing them out is going to be a pain in the ass. And am I just going to lose all the armor I currently have trying to gain cloth for more armor? I don't know. I think maybe we should just push the cave. As is with the little bit of armor we got. Just be smart. I got the gun now. Well, we had the gun last time too, I believe. Yeah, 
I didn't I didn't change the um, the season length, which was one of the downsides to when I started this playthrough. Um, so yeah, my seasons are gonna be a little short. It is what it is. Not the end of the world. I do enjoy the longer seasons though, but. Mm, we got a storm coming in. Good thing we're going in a cave. IR, how you doing today, man? No, Kelvin's alive. No, Kelvin is not dead. Kelvin is not dead. Alright, so let's see here. Uh, stun baton. Lighter. So we got a decent bit of handgun ammo. We still got some grenades. Did he respawn after I, I didn't I didn't murder him? He he didn't need to respawn because he's he didn't die. Where's this for fictitious lies coming from guys now all of a sudden I murdered Calvin Calvin has been perfectly fine hey Clayton and thank you so much for the membership welcome to the family man how you doing I don't know if the enemies respond. I don't I don't know how respawns work. I'm pretty sure if you log out, log in though, they probably respawn. See shit. That's one down. I can barely see over there. fly way different
It's like, oh no, I can't see. Okay, so now the thing is, is the scuba tank is this way, guys. I went that way, which is the way to get the stun gun. Not mandatory. So what I'm going to do, though, is we're going to grab the scuba tank first. Hey, Sunny with the gifted membership, brother. Thank you so much. Whoever receives that, welcome to the fam. Um... Any, uh, any chance I'm going to finish the Red Dead Redemption? So, when we played Red Dead Redemption 2 modded, um, I had no intention on, like, doing a whole nother playthrough of that game. Only because it's a very long game. Um, even with the mods, it doesn't change the game all that much. You know what I mean? It was fun. There's, like, fun little interactions and situations that we get in. But it wouldn't have been much different than my initial playthrough. So, no, I had no intention on playing that all the way through. It would have just been very redundant content um only because it's if the, if the story's not going to change with mods the only thing that's going to change is kind of the, the moments here to there uh now i'm not saying i'll never play red dead redemption 2 again because it's my favorite game of all time but uh in the in the current situation on the channel yeah there was just no reason to replay it fully Do I have any plans? I, I plan on I plan on checking out Hell Divers too. Don't know exactly how that's gonna work. Um, Cause I honestly had no intent. The only reason why I am checking out the game is because so many of you guys have asked me to check out the game. Uh, it's, it's really not my kind of game, as you guys know. I like more immersive, story-driven games. Those like shooters games like that. They're fun, but after like a couple hours, I'll, I'll I would be okay and never want to play the game again. Cause I would just have my fill. But who knows? I'm, I'm sitting here talking about a game I've never played. It could be fucking phenomenal, and I could be absolutely obsessed with it. So, who knows? Uh, I just say, initially, it was not on my radar whatsoever. Got some body parts here. Now... There's, there is a fucking shark in here. So every time I came in this cave, guys, that shark never was here. And I remember the first time I came in this cave, I was just swimming around like it was nothing, like dinking around in the water. Didn't even know there was a fucking shark in there. Look at what, that's a. Are you kidding me, dude? Yeah, I heard that if you throw the body parts that it distracts the shark. So that's why I actually picked those up. We'll see how it goes. But we're not making our great escape yet anyways. I still want to go back up into the other part of the cave and try to get my hands on that stun gun. Ooh, cloth. Scuba gear. Oh, wait, once you drop. 
Oh, fuck, dude, don't just go in the water like that shit don't mean nothing. I think once you drop down here, can we even get back up? Yeah, we go. There we go. Uh, ball skate out the, uh, the snow runner. A lot, a lot of you guys have, the game's actually been requested quite a bit. Um, I'm not saying I'll never play it. No, I just, I'm willing to try anything once, right? It's just a matter, there's just so much going on right now, though, that, you know, financially, if I just go out and buy a game just to play it once, it sucks. You know what I mean? Because generally the return on investment isn't there. And just in the way that all, with all the new games and stuff coming out, it's just like, you know, 40 to $60 could be thrown at something so much better. You know what I mean? I don't have a flashlight yet. Um, there is one in the game. We just have not got it yet. Could actually probably make our way up north and get that. God damn it. Almost out of flares. Let me see where those fucking arrows are going. Definitely blew the guy into pieces. Oh. Newer to your streams. Keep it up with the solid content, brother. 
Hey, Justina, thank you so much for that. That is a huge super chat, brother. It's good to have you here. As always, man, I appreciate the love and uh, I appreciate that support, man. It's absolutely insane. I hope you're having a good day today, bro. All right. Uh, Perfect right now. I freaking use my last one. Let me see if we can. Explosive 3D printed arrow? Oh, those are new, guys. This is, this is new, guys. This is new. Can't see goddamn thing. Can't see. Hello, Brian. Hey, Sergeant Place, what's going on? How you doing? I couldn't see. I was literally just whipping them arrows in. I have no more flares. I used them all up. Oh, here we go, here we go. We get to get some mutant skin right here. This is who I was looking for. I was looking for the big guy. Sergeant Place, thank you so much for the super chat. How you doing today? Yeah, there's other type of arrows. I, that was my first time ever seeing those. I didn't know that they added that. Is that a part of 1.0 or have those been in for a while? There, we got another grenade. I would make a torch, but I don't want to waste the cloth right now when we got this. I'm about to go get a flashlight. Really happy about those exploding arrows, though. That that was that was that was clutch. They've been in for a while. Yeah, like I said, I haven't kept up with like the past like Shadow No, it's been a, it's been a lot of videos get ooh, maybe maybe I could use a Molotov. Maybe, can't forget we got we could craft
That was a really good molly, dude. It's like a room in there. Break yourself, fool. What if the taser's even any good? All right, so now we don't even got to swim out. We'll just go back out the entrance. Anderson, what's up, brother? How you doing, man? Anderson was playing the greatest game of all time today. He was playing some uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. Kelvin, see if it works. Really? No, why would we taste? Kelvin is my boy. That's my... That worked well, actually. That worked quite well. I never used this thing. I usually always just use this, the handgun, but uh, that actually worked out quite well. One, Axon two, stun baton. Yeah, we are getting quite hungry. I mean, I could pop an MRE. What? I got? I had soup at home. No, I guess we'll eat an MRE. Screw it. Yeah, we had soup at home. We already cooked it. I was trying to, you know, don't want to waste resources. Uh, Money Mike, thank you so much. Or Money Mikey, thank you so much for the nine months, man. How you doing today? Anderson with the super chat, brother. Thank you so much. And then Sergeant plays. Holy crap, dude. And with the hardened survivor membership, that is actually huge, brother. I really appreciate that, man. Welcome to the fam. Anderson again, but I appreciate the love. Yeah, so the stun gun's not bad. Like I said, I never used it before, really, in my previous playthroughs. Uh, well, we're going to try to get the flashlight now, too. Make cave dwelling a little less of an eye strain. I think it's going to be nighttime. Cruise control with the 18 months. Thank you so much. How you doing today, man? Oh, 
don't think this is gonna work, but I'm gonna try anyways. This thing has like an activation distance that you need to... Wow, that actually worked. Actually work, dude. That's what I do, chat. They call me the hand glider 9000, baby. Hand glider. 9000. Too easy. So all you need is just a little, maybe 20 foot drop or something like that, and uh, you can get this thing up operational. You guys thought the moped was OP, or the little unicycle thing. This is the ultimate form of transportation. Now you do gotta you get you do gotta play your uh, your elevation, play that bubble. But as long as you play a good game with this bubble, you'll be all right. All right, Miguel, what's going on? How you doing? Hey, easy, cheesy way to get the pistol, right, guys? Just hang glide out to it. Sergeant plays with another super chat, man. Let's go, dude. It's too easy, right? Have any of you guys ever built a base up on top of that mountain? Ooh, we got some speed. I do want to build some, uh, that's probably what we're going to do in the morning, actually. Get our base figured out a little. Ooh, okay. Wow, that is a big group, and they're wearing, like, luminescent fucking paint on their body. I don't know what kind of what clan this is. So if you guys don't know, there's different clans of uh of the cannibals. Some of them more aggressive than others. 
these guys have like luminescent paint. I, I, I don't know who these guys are. They do seem quite aggressive though. They're, they're pushing me right now. If they're gonna keep pursuing me, if they're gonna kind of go away, I can barely fucking see, dude. It's so dark, chat. I can barely make out like the little luminescent paint. I'm hiding in the bush. Hope they'll just give up and keep it moving. I don't want to fight back right now. I don't want to make these. Uh, this is that'll be a nasty fight, man. There's like six of these dudes. See, so just hide. They should take off. A lot of them over here still. They're fucking looking for me, dude. It's like right in front of me. Searching with fucking lights. They're searching with lights, dude. They found me. <laughs> they found me, chat. To leave me alone. There's only two of them right now. If I gotta tase one of them, I'll tase him. Nope, they're definitely. Use the night V light. I come in peace, brother. Yes, peace. That might have been a different clan, actually. That, that, that guy didn't have the luminescent paint on their body. That's what I'm saying. There's different clans. 
Um, that that guy didn't look like he was a part of the same group. Uh, let's see if we can fucking pass a night. There we go. That was a hell of a night, dude. Jesus Christ. Run, bro. You know, Sergeant Bill, I, that, that's what I was, I was trying to get away, man. We did it, though. We. Oh, that's. See, this is a different group coming. Um, they seem quite aggressive. Come on, brother, don't do this, man. Trying to break my shit. How do you guys want to do it? What do you? What do you guys want to do here? I'm not letting you fucking surround me. That's not happening, bro. So how about we all just get along? You guys go do your thing. I'll go do mine. What's on their face? There, bro. Whoa, whoa. How about that? I didn't want to do it, dude. I didn't want to fucking do it. But you left me no damn choice. And now look at you. Now look at you. Yeah. You see what happens? Yeah. Just sit there and. Disbelief, not understanding what's going on, dude. Oh, 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 shut up. It was a choice, chat. That was a choice, and they made the wrong one. We can actually start working on some bone. Um, let's see here. So where the hell is the bonfires at? Or is that in the other book? Yeah, it's in this book. Reinforce bonfire. Okay, so first we start off with some sticks. We cut logs in half. In quarters. Okay, so bonfire is just the third layer, so we I think I got this. Let me see. Hey, 
Yeah, I mean, you guys seen it. I tried to be peaceful that whole time. I really did. Um, I can only do so much. The, the guy decided to fucking throw a whole spear at me. Like, what the hell, bro? So we'll cook him down to bone. The other body parts despawned probably because I blew him into so many pieces. But we got a little bit of bone here. Man, this is getting extra crispy, dude. Oh my god, look at the body. Calvin Ice, you scared the shit out of me, bro. Have I seen some people streaming in 21? I, I haven't seen it, George. It's, it's generally not anything over uh, even 1440. Most, a lot of guys don't even stream in 1440. A lot of guys, like the bigger guys, they stream in 1080p because um, when I looked at it, I think it's only 30% of my viewers even watch 1440. Um, everybody else is 1080p and below. Like, you'd be surprised at how many people watching 720. And it's not, it has nothing to do with my internet. Like, and that, that's the thing that you got to take into consideration when it comes to streaming. Is like, you could, I could have the best internet in the world. I could st stream in 4K. But. Scary for sure. Got to build that house. Brian as a savage. Oh, look at, they put this shit in my base area. Um, but most of the viewers aren't going to be able to watch it in 4K or, or 1440. So it's just a waste of resources, realistically. Just no point in it. Yeah, they're trying to put freaking their little markers down on my, my area. They're trying to claim my spot. Dude, we're going to have some issues, dude. But now we're going to be able to do up some... Got a storm coming in. That's a choice, chat. That's a thumbnail, guys. All right, so let me come up with a plan here, guys. What are we going to do for building? Uh,
Okay. Need to get Calvin back to work. Come on, bro. Get logs and fill holders. Like this, so we not to make so many damn trips back and forth. Okay, got a nice base there. Or a nice foundation. Yeah, after last night's attack, we gotta we gotta fortify a little bit, guys. But we're gonna be screwed. Um if they come and attack us in force, we're caught out open and open in that little tent situation like last night. It's going to get real bad real quick. Oh wow, it did all four of them, or both logs at once. Let 
Nope, that's not what we want. We want. Crane, brother, thank you so much with the one month, man. I hope you're excited about today, bro. Because I'm excited about today. For you, man. I guess I could probably do the announcement right now just to give everybody a heads up about today after my stream's over. Crane's uh, celebrating his 20,000 subscriber. Uh, so, like he's doing his 20,000 subscriber celebration today on his channel. Uh, and he's giving away. All right, Chess, so you got to hear me out. If, if you're my. If you guys are my ride or dies, right? You got to do this for me. You ready, chat? Crane's going to be doing about 150 giveaways today for Pokemon TCG. As you guys know, I collect. Okay? I collect. So what happened is we're going to raid his stream. All right? Now listen. We're going to raid his stream. And I need as many of you guys. All you got to do to sign up for the giveaway is just, like, type in chat. And if you guys win, you just got to let me get it. Just let me get it. <laughs> and with all of our powers combined, yo, we could win. We <laughs> we could win like all the giveaways, dude. Nah, but seriously, if you guys win, hey, congrats, for real. Uh, let me actually get it. No, nah, no, but for real, though. Uh, it's going to be a good time. Uh, I'll, I'm going to definitely be over there trying to win some shit. Uh, it'd be awesome to see you guys actually win. Even if you don't collect, you know. Turn around and sell that shit, man. It'll be a good time, though. So yeah, we'll be popping over there for that. We'll send the boot gang out in force. What do you mean scamming? I'm not scamming. I'm I was being straight up honest out the gate. Whoa, oh shit, here we go, here we go. What's up, dude? Now, these guys will destroy your shit quick. Oh, hold on there, hold on there, big boy, hold on. <laughs> yeah, you see what fucking happened, lady? See what happened to your boy? Of course, dude, man. Congrats again, man. 20K is no joke, dude. Where is your... Is she... make me do this chat she was i thought it, she looked like she might have been pregnant man I, I wasn't trying to do it to her she was beating calvin's ass <laughs> she was beating calvin's ass dude oh god Calvin, 
by the way, dude, why aren't you working? Probably should build him a uh, stick holders up here, right? Close to the trees. Yeah, let's do that. And get two of these set up up here for you, Calvin. Yeah, you guys know me. I, I was trying. I was trying to spare him. I, I didn't want to do it to him, but. It left me no choice. Big dude came running at me. She came beating the shit out of Kelvin. Oh, that's sick. Oh, so it drops it in bundles now when you break it up. Yo, that is so much better. And it looked like I might have got a full refund. Now they did a good job, man. The game feels really, really good. Uh, just small little tweaks, you know, and, and it's the AI, the environment, the map, like it really is, it's so immersive, you know what I mean? It, it just feels so real. Okay, Calvin, come here. Here, come here. This is your duty station, all right? You hold it down, you go cut some logs, put them in the soldiers. Got it? He's got it. Alright, we're hungry and thirsty. We gotta go fucking eat before we start losing health. Actually, I got this MRE. Damn, of course I got rotten meat, rotten fish. Let's actually go boil some water up. Fill my damn canteen. Oh, so you don't lose health on hard? Okay, that's cool then. I thought I was going to lose health. When do you start losing health, though, when you're starving? I'm just going to boil up water. I am going to chop a little bit more firewood here. We'll let that cook up. Kelvin's up there doing his thing. I got to get this other log holder built for him. He didn't have time to heal between his ass kickings. He said run around at 1% just constantly. <laughs> Listen, I'm trying my best for this man, though. You know, I I I wait. I used a bullet. I used a bullet. All right, to save Calvin. I didn't have to. I could have just let her beat him down. I used a whole bullet to save Calvin.
Oh yeah, Virginia's. I don't know where she is. She she just comes and goes. Okay, there we go. So those two are set up there. We could probably set up two more, and Calvin will be extra busy. You know, for right now we'll do we'll do one more. So now we got that full up. We're just going to drink this. Love the fact that we got all that bone too. Eighteen more. So, damn, we've been attacked, what, twice already? We got attacked, well, three times. Then we got attacked last night. Then that first scout, that first party came in the morning that we blew up. And then we got another attack all in the same day. Make a couple of water. Yeah, we're. You know what? Before the snow comes, we probably should go out and farm a bunch of turtle shells because I'm pretty sure in the winter time it's re you can't find turtles. Uh, because we're gonna need turtle shells for rain collectors, and we're gonna need turtle shells for uh more of the little things that shoot me up into the air, the catapults. So I'd like to get a couple of those set up around the map. Miguel, thank you so much for the gifted. I appreciate it. Whoever receives that, welcome to the fam. All right, so we should have enough to finish our flooring here, I'm hoping. So I always do this. Like, and this isn't even a big place, man. But uh, I get a little overzealous with my builds. And then it ends up costing me all the resources to build it. Might need one more log. Uh run of logs to finish this. No, I think we're going to be okay. Perfect. Damn, birds. We are not going to be set for nighttime. I'll tell you that. We are not going to be good. <sighs> right, before it gets dark, let's go see if we can find... Uh, see if we can find any turtles.
I already be getting too cold for the damn turtles. I think there's freshwater turtles too. Oh, there's some right there, I think. Yep. What's up, buds? Die. No, 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 you can't run, bro. Hold on, no, 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 stop. You son of a bitch. Why would he run? Virginia. How you doing? Thank you. You want me to follow you? Hold on, let me let me get this turtle real quick. Okay, well, there, yep, yeah, whatever. We got two turtles so far. Oh, there's one coming back. No, no, don't throw it all in the fucking water, dude. Holy crap. That's a shell, man. Let's try to push this up to the shore. We'll come back over and grab it. Come back and grab that real quick. It's about to get dark here in a second. Ah, Sergeant Place with another super chat, man. Bro, turn Riz level 9,000. Virginia's my homegirl, though. She, she, she's looking out, always. Always looking out. Can I put the turtle shells on here? Mm -hmm. 
Shit. Sonny with the gifted. Thank you so much, man. Hope you're having a good day today. That was that was that was close. That was real, real close. So yet again, another raid. Oh, shit. They will not let me live in peace, will they? Big group of them, man. Go. Said go. Man, I wish I had that fucking bonfire set up, man. We'd be at, we'd have bones galore. Hi, I don't know if the bodies will still be here in the morning. Let's see. They let me sleep. Okay, so the bodies are still here. Let's see if we can get the bonfire set up.
Yeah, they're hitting us hard, man. Probably already took too much time not setting up a base, you know what I mean? So, get all these bodies burning. They broke my damn... It's all just falling apart at the seams chat. It's all just falling apart. Everything. God damn it. Another, are you kidding me, dude? There's another attack party. I don't know how much if I have enough ammo for this shot. Dude, leave. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> These seven. See what happens, bro? Yeah.
<laughs> I do what I gotta do, chat. You know what I mean? He didn't beg me for anything, man. They, you can't come try to kill me and then beg for mercy, bro. Like, that's not how it works. That's just, that's not how it works. Good bit of bone though. Good bit of bone, guys. Thirsty and hungry as hell right now. Now we got a good bit of, uh, let's see, so the bone armor, what does it take? Tape and rope. As you guys can see, though, I'm definitely not the aggressor. They are. Once we get our base set up, though, a bit, we'll be able to actually build a perimeter, maybe get some traps down, get some effigies down to try to convince these guys that I'm not the one. Canned food. We got an extra pot up there. We got more ropes down here. So let me actually see about crafting up some of that bone armor. Okay, so we'll throw some bone on there, some tape, some rope. Yeah, you make explosive air. So the thing is, is now that they did add more craftable things with explosives, uh, it does feel a lot more viable than previous. Because uh, the only explosive you could make was like that time bomb. But yeah, the explosive arrows probably should have some more of those crafted up for when the big groups come. We could just freaking whack. Just try to get them all real quick.
Um, let's go ahead and wear this and this. Okay, so we got the floor done here. Um, let's go up and see how much of this Kelvin got done up. Did you put a content warning on the stream? I wouldn't doubt it. I mean, this game is pretty, pretty graphic at points. So first things first, uh, to this wall. Okay, and then this. And then we're going to wedge it, and I should be able to take out all the middle supports. This has to be a half. Allows to pull out the middle pieces here. But we still actually need to leave some of this stuff for a doorway. Um, where the hell do I want this doorway to be? I was figuring we'd do the doorway here. Yeah, it's gonna look nice. Where's Calvin at? Hey, follow me, Calvin. We got some decent armor on though. We got we got a decent bit of bone armor. We got some mutant armor on right now. Get logs, dude.
Go get the zipline gun? Yeah, I would. I, I think in order to get the zipline gun, no. No, it's in order to get the shovel, you need the zipline gun. I don't remember what cave the zipline gun's in. But I can't afford to not build a base right now. It's just every day, every night, we're consistently getting attacked. So we got to make sure that we get some kind of defenses up. Whoa, is that it? I have not seen a fucking hawk before. And it's got a fish. I don't know if that's a hawk or an eagle, guys. It's a big ass bird. Yeah, and the winter time's coming. Yeah, we definitely gotta have good shelter before. I didn't even think about that. Yeah, it's shelter before winter, man. Stop. We gotta definitely stop dragging our feet. God, no way. That is a big attack party. What the hell? Want to do it to him, chat. As always, you guys know me. I'm all about the peace. Problem is we're gonna run out of ammo here soon. Yeah, there's more bone. There's only one of the guys we can cook up. You can't cook the big red dudes and you can't cook the, the girls. You can't you can't cook them up, I don't think. Maybe if you set their bodies on fire individually, but at least with the, the bonfire, because you can't pick them up. I thought she looked pregnant too. That's why I didn't kill her initially. Um, I was like, yo, that's kind of sketch. The way she was like holding her stomach and stuff. I don't know, Chad. There still is a chance she was. I don't know. You see the way her back's like arched and stuff? But if you look at this lady's belly, do you, would you say she looked more pregnant than fat? No. Huh? Nah, I don't know. Maybe she's just she's just big, chat. Not him. He's got that. He's got the good belly. 
He's just been drinking them, them cannibal beers. Okay, so we got those set now. Uh, let's do this. We need two halves. go so that's all set okay. pull these out yeah screw it So yeah, when we get over here, we're going to cut. I was thinking about doing it. I don't know. Can you do a double door in this game? What, what videos are you talking about? Oh, it did. Oh. Uh. Actually, quite tired too. Papa energy bar. Yeah, so I, I missed the super chat. Stefan with the eight months, not the aggressor with a backpack full of their limbs. <laughs> Just waving around behind your back as they walk past it. And listen, the only reason why I had their limbs, right, in the first place was because they started it. They started with me. I don't know if you can cut out a, a double door. Two single doors. Jump on the shell trampoline with no glider for science. I don't. I don't. I don't think it pro propels you without the uh, glider. Like I think you need to have the glider in order to. Because even when the cannibals were stepping on it, they didn't like go flying up. I mean, we could try it. Why not? 
Or science, right? Yeah, there is only one way to find out. For science! Dude, look at all them logs over there. Look at all them logs over there. Kelvin just got all over the place, chat. We gotta go clean those up. He's cutting logs, not even being organized. I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna lie, chat. This the when I did that, my my stomach kind of sank a little bit. <laughs> Yeah, he has a strategy. You want me going to freaking pick him up? Babe, does this make your stomach sink? And I'm free! Oh, why would you do that? Huh? Because it's for the glider. <laughs> Yeah, you're supposed to have this thing and go like this. Right, let's go scoop up these logs that Kelvin just decided to spread all over the goddamn place. My son asked to play Sons of the Forest with me. I'm like, I should have him. <laughs> I should have him come on and, and, and put him to work like Calvin did. <laughs> put him to work like Calvin. I'm like, hey, no, you see all those logs, dude? Yeah, take the sled and go grab them, bro. <laughs> go grab all those logs, dude. Come on, dude, stop it. Push that log cart on the trampoline. Or Kelvin. I watched. I think Kelvin stepped on it. He didn't go anywhere though when he stepped on it. What the hell? There it is.
Oh yeah, these are so confident. I wonder if these have. Huh? No, he doesn't. <laughs> Some canned food. Push yes. that log cart onto the trampoline, or Kelvin. I'll see what happens if we push a log cart onto it, though, Chris. <laughs> Dude, Chris, thank you so much for the super chat, brother. I appreciate it. In Co-Rage with the 16 months, man. We're having a great day. What do you think about the update worth a revisit? And also, how's the standing desk? I am, I stood uh, like a week ago. I haven't been standing lately. My back's been pretty decent, so I haven't had to... Anytime my, my, my sciatica starts acting up, though, I'll start standing again. Um, but I definitely think the update's nice, man. There's, it's a lot of little quality life changes. I mean, ultimately, it's still the same game, you know what I mean? Uh, but it does feel, it feels really good. It feels really, really good. Yeah, more attacks incoming. I, I, I know, Chad. We... Let me see how much ammo we have. Oh, let's see, let's see what happens if we... Hold on, let me save. Because if I freaking put this log sled on there and it goes flinging into the stratosphere... I'll be in my feelings. <laughs> Tim, thank you so much for the super chat, man. Glad you're playing it. I'm, I'm glad I'm playing it again, man. This is one of my favorite survival games. God damn. Well, it made a loud ass bang. But it didn't go flying. It sounded like a shotgun going off. I heard that at night uh, when I think one of the cannibals stepped on it. I don't know if it actually per launched them, but I thought it was a, a thunder. I thought it was thunder. Glad you're playing this again. Cool, cool, cool. We're getting there though, guys. Space is almost completely enclosed. We should be able to finish it tomorrow. Calvin looks like he's got a decent bit of logs up there. The goal is to get one of these built inside too. Then we're going to take all this stuff moving inside. You can separate those turtle shells from the launch pad and place them anywhere Vulcan salute cool. Really? Star King, or Scar King, thank you so much for the super chat, man. Well, that... Is that Virginia or some? Oh, hey Virginia. Hey, if I give you this pistol, are you gonna actually stay around my base? The problem is I give her the pistol, guys, I'll never see her again. She's just gonna fucking leave. Hopefully, uh, we have to pass the night. It's going to be too dark for me to try to do this right now. Please don't know attack. Get attacked. 
Do you think, Virginia? Do you think? Do you think? Shoot him, Virginia! Shoot him! Give Virginia the pistol. Yeah. See what happens when I give Virginia the, the pistol chat. So I don't trust AI with anything. Thank you. Damn, it's cold as hell. Did she just run away? Oh, and it's fucking snowing, dude. Run from it, bro. Oh, dear God, chat. This is really happening like this right now. Snow's come down. I can't even see. Got any sticks to light a fire? It's gonna be hard to keep this going. Yeah. That worked well. Yeah, it looks like the, the sun might actually be coming up anyways. Let me see what time is it. Yeah, it's 6 o'clock in the morning, so we're good. We passed a good bit of the night before we were attacked, so... There's that, but now it's, uh... Winter Wonderland, we're going to be cold as hell. Right, we really got to get this structure done. Oh, yeah, I plan on trying Monster Hunter World. Yep, I actually own it. Um, I have the game already. I just haven't got around to playing it yet. Oh, I never finished that one. Yeah, we got enough wood here. I think we should be able to finish. It's 
So we got our first snow of the year. And of course, it came at the worst possible time. We didn't even get a... We, we spent a lot of the beginning, like, few days, you know, just running around, doing whatever. Because I'm so used to playing on the long seasons. I used to play... So, like... It's not till like day 15 or so until I really see winter time on my usual playthroughs. But this one, as you can see, we uh, winter started early. Mm, that's broken. Uh, how the hell do you repair shit? This. I think there's a repair hammer in the game, right? Yeah, repair tool is rope and stone. Going on, breaking my shit, man. So let's start off by doing this. Get some overhead coverage going so we can at least get a spot for the bed. Yeah, we're going food. I can't even build a double bed dead though. I think we need a deer hide for that, and I haven't we haven't we haven't started hunting deer yet reliably. Actually, I've never killed a deer. What is my log slide? Uh, I, uh, it's lights. Yeah, it, it'll light up the area at nighttime, so you'll be able to see around the log slide. Um, it's the advanced log slide. There's two of them in the game. There's one that do doesn't have the skulls, uh, and then there's the one that does. What if the cold weather is going to slow down the cannibals at all? I highly doubt it.
Okay, I see. Get this covered up now. Um. No, so I'll have to support this in order to take that one out, right? These guys have been coming at me so hard, though. I really feel like I need to go and enact revenge on their camps. What the hell? What the hell even happened there? What? What? I don't understand how that log got twisted like that. Let me take that shit down. That is so weird. Chop it down. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that was weird, man. Wait, what? Is, what? Hold on, is this damage or something? Love you. Airborne's first. He was the first winner on cranes, really? Let me get it, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Chat, does anybody know what's happening here? Look, I do that and then boom, it flings over there. Hmm. Maybe we can do this. I 
And then... Do... Nope. There we go. Okay. I had to do it from this way, and it was, I was able to get it to go. Perfect. All right, we're good, we're good, we're good. Perfect. Okay, now I can take this half. Stick it there. We can take this one out. Boom. All right. That was a cluster, but we got it figured out. You're so nice. Well, I mean, next time you hand me some shit, don't fucking bury it in the goddamn ground. Where... So bright. Kelvin out here earning his keep, Jet. See, I put food on the table, and he works good. Give him a place to sleep. Kelvin's a happy camper. Damn, I still don't even think we're about to finish this whole thing by the night. Okay. Gotta get like a rope or something back here. And uh, yeah, I'll probably do a rope. That way if I do get attacked, I can um How do you do that? Okay, so it had to make it support another way when you took out the post. The fuck is this? This is different than it. Zachary, thank you for the super chat. Yeah, it, that, that, that's what I think is when I pulled that post, it kind of made it go kind of wonky. But it's all good. Yeah, I, I don't remember how to put the rope up, chat. Like, I thought you just walked up to it and... Is that for rope bridge? Oh, okay. 
So how do I just put the normal rope? Oh, like that. Okay, I see it. Got it. Good throw. That was a good throw. I don't know. We might be able to get a good bit of this done today. hard because it wants to put the log there i want it to do that okay so we do got a little bit of overhead coverage uh this is where i'll be cutting the doors out or the door out um actually maybe we'll do the door on this side because it'll be off center if i do it on this side you know what i mean Get this place figured out how we want to lay this out. So we're gonna switch over to this furniture. Um, yeah, see the double bed requires the deer pelt. I don't have that right now. So we'll have to roll with this bad boy for now. Yeah, so the bed is a safe spot, uh, also a rest spot, because your, your guy gets tired and exhausted. And it allows you to pass time, so if you don't want to be out during the night, and you want to skip the night time, you, you go to bed, and it skips to the morning. Unless you get attacked in the middle of the night like I have been. Definitely seems like cannibal activity is down by 90% ever since the winter time came. We gotta get another. Now. We cook on the. Campfire. Is there like a. Nice build. Like, like, can you cook on a stone fireplace? That's a lot, though. Holy shit, man. That's a lot of stone. I mean, the fireplace looks real nice, guys. It, it, it is, but... We're talking 42 stones, and it's wintertime, so it's going to be hard as hell to even locate the stones. We 
tell Calvin to get stones. <laughs> we'll tell we'll tell Calvin to go get them. Now can I put uh my guy's starving right now. Yeah, we can we can have Kelvin gather stones for us. Let's just finish this structure here. Well, the reason why I wanted the fireplace is because right now I, I can't in the snow when I do the regular fire but it just goes out instantly so we got to figure out another way for fire and I can't even boil up any more water or anything until we can get that squirt away So probably two more loads and we're good. We'll be done. We'll start being able to cut some holes in. Um, I'm gonna build one of those firewood holders because we're gonna have a lot of uneven pieces. We're gonna need a lot of firewood.
Okay, so the roof is done. Let me see. Can I put that rope up here too? Go back on here. Yeah, we could put it on. To it right there. That way, now we can like defend from up here too. Now, once we cut out, like I said, we're gonna we're gonna build the uh, we're gonna build some shelves. We're also gonna cut out the windows and stuff. But I'm gonna I'm gonna cut out the windows and stuff first because I think you can end up with like half logs, and that's what we'll need for shelves. I know this. You see me out here really building these bases, right? This one's got a roof and everything. Okay, so we got that. Let's go. Let's see, so we'll cut out the door on this side right here. Yeah. Okay, so we got that done. That's good. It's good enough for right now. Where's Kelvin? Uh, oh, Virginia, thank you. <laughs> Thought I heard growling. Zachary with another super chat. Poor Calvin. All that slavery. Yo, he's eating. Nah, Cal Calvin's living good, guys. He's living better than I am. Like, I'm over here building cabins. All he's got to do is cut down trees, man. He's living it. He's got it easy. He's got it real, real easy. So we're going to move. Let's actually go get him off this duty. We're going to have him go gra gather sticks. Got more than enough logs now.
Right, as soon as he drops these, we'll uh, tell him to follow us, gather sticks, and hey, cover, cover, cover here. Damn, bro, why are you so bloody? Somehow gonna be my fault that Calvin's all bloody, right, chat? Somehow, it's always, it's always it's always my fault. We need stone, but that's that's low priority. The fireplace. Um, we'll just figure out another way to do a fire for now. So we tell him he's gonna go get. Yeah, he's gonna go gather sticks. He'll fill up these holders for us. We gotta get this bed done though. Boom. So we got a cannibal pretty far out. Nope. Virginia? Relentless, guys. So, we're just putting in some work. She's not... If, we had, if she had the shotgun, I feel like she'd be super, super good, but... She's still putting in some work with that. Using up quite a bit of my arrows. These these stone arrows are pretty garbage, man. I feel like they're even worse than they used to be. Now, can you, I wonder if you could light a campfire inside? Actually, let's drop these rotten body parts out of my inventory.
Okay, we drop that there. Hit him with an arrow, he ran off. No big guy come or, nope, same guy coming back. Virginia, he's coming back. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Oh. Don't worry, Virginia. I'll take care of it. Mm -hmm. I'll take care of it. As per the use, you know what I mean, guys? Damn, Kelvin's really taking a sweet ass time getting sticks, man. All the wood on the beach. I didn't think that was going to be all that hard of a task. Now we got to figure out lights uh, on the inside here. We, we want a little bit of illumination. So we can do the wall torches and the ceiling skull lamps. I don't know what these are. What? What? There we go. Okay, that's pretty good. Actually, we got a ton of skulls, so. So yeah, we got to get a door built. I actually forgot how to make doors. Sunny with the gifted. Thank you so much. Use light bulbs and solar panels. Yeah, I... Actually, I do have... Well, I don't know how to hook up the power. We'll have to figure that out. So yeah, I do have some solar panels. Let's see here. Yeah, this is a part of the update I haven't... I don't really know anything about. So we got solar panels here. So what do you just lay them on the roof? Okay. And then what? Wire maybe? Oh, hold on. Let me go and place the bulbs first. Wait, how do you? Oh, no, no. You got to put you got to do the I think you got to do the, the wire, right? And then attach the bulbs to the wire.
There we go. There was like no use for wire in this game. It was such a good change, man. And then I think we, we can put the... Can we attach the bulbs to this? What's going on up here? Should we connect? Attach a battery? Shit. Okay. Well, we're out of the Stone Age. Uh, let me see. I don't remember how to make a door at all. Feel we're gonna get attacked. That's an explosive. Oh, it's a big guy. Yo, where the fuck is Virginia, dude? See, this is why I don't like to give the AI the guns, guys. They're just too unreliable, man. Way too unreliable. Stop hitting my shit. So I hit him with that explosive, dude. He, he, he was over it. We'll finish this uh, door in the morning. Hopefully that was it for the... Oh, we're hungry as hell and thirsty. Get another pistol. I mean, I could get another pistol, but that would require me to, like, swim out in the ocean again in the middle of the winter time. You know what I mean? Like, that doesn't even sound like a good plan. Is 
The water's gonna be so cold. Okay, good. All right, Calvin, listen. Um, yeah, let's do a... Uh, do up a stone storage over here for Calvin. That way I can just kind of come over here with the log sled and just pick it up. And you saw the, all these stones here. He'll be able to start picking up for me. Can Calvin finish off blueprints? Uh, from what I've heard, yeah. I, I guess you can tell him to finish building structures, and he'll just start building. But I don't know if he needs the resources or if he'll go collect said resources and then build them. You know what I mean? I don't know how that works. Can you swim to the pistol at night? For science, I could never do, I could never do that. Kevin, come here. Cut lights out there today. The charge. Oh, okay. I, yeah. I'm, okay. I'm tracking. I see how this works. All right. Here we go. Yeah. Lots and lots of rocks in this area for this man. So. Get. Rocks, right? No. Get stones, the holders. So stones are the big ones. Rocks are the smaller ones. I'm not scared of sharks. No, I wasn't worried about the sharks, guys. It's the 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 cold. What do you mean? It's snowing outside. Like if you were outside in this weather, tell me you're gonna go for a dip. Ah, Chad, that's not even that's. Virginia literally took off with my gun. She's off living her best life. Let's finish off the shelves real quick. What are you doing, bro? I know damn well you are not done. He's eating. Oh, the meat goes rotten up there if you don't... Okay, so you can... Only store the dried meat. Oh, all these are... Oh, man, all this shit's rotten. Okay.
Yeah, we had a bunch of rotten food. That kind of stinks, man. Thought I had more food than I than I actually do. I don't have that flare gun, guys. I don't have any flares, period. I don't even remember there being a flare gun in this game, Chet. Yeah, I, we got the choppers. I don't know what to do when they show up. What's that lopsided looking? What the fuck? And then we're going to get some actual bone holders down just so we can, uh, get some of them out of our cart. Yeah, we got I want to get some of them out of the cart because my whole entire thing here is the sides are full, so I can't even pick up any more, uh, or anything like that. And these hold up to 50 bone, man. Why are you standing here looking at me, bro? Why aren't you doing what I told you to do? This man grabbed five whole rocks. Four. Alright, do what I said. Get... Rocks or stones fill holders.
No, nah, it only had four rocks in it. He just took his lunch break and then, you know how Kelvin's brain is. He just forgot what he was doing, so. Get some progress here. We can go store some of this stuff. Uh, food wise, we're doing okay. So let's go. Why is he back, chat? I need him to grab those rocks, man. Like, I'm trying to build this fucking fireplace. There's rocks all over the place. Okay, so... Well, do something, dude. Get some freaking sticks, okay? And fill the holders. So we'll have this building, we'll have, so we got that. The, the thing I like about this game, though, is you can, uh, you can set the blueprints and then, uh, like, go around and, like, add to them as you go. You can lay your whole base out. For bone armor, shelf, wall shelves. So we'll grab these. We should be able to build this whole table up. No problem. Yep, there it is. And then on the table, we'll go ahead and build... I don't know how big these are going to be, but I wanted to see. So we have... Arrow storage.
And then we have explosive holder. It's actually quite huge. God damn it. Um I'm gonna chop all this in a firewood here in a sec. Once we get well, once we get that firewood holder built, a lot of this is gonna get chopped up. Actually, we might be able to use these four for the legs. Just trying to rearrange this a little bit to make it a little more functional. Those birds, man. So we got these three things that we can build here. Snow is relentless. I guess that's what happens when it's winter time, right? Calvin works better if he has time to eat and rest in between tasks. Oh. I mean, I haven't even been pushing him that hard. He's just... It's like when I randomly, I, like, need him to do something, it's just like, oh, now it's an issue. You know, oh, I need to sleep. It's like, bro, you had all this time to do whatever the hell you want. The second I actually, you know, come go out of my way to ask you to do something, I, out of all the things I've been up to, you know, we have not asked Calvin for shit. I asked that man to do one thing for me, and all of a sudden, now he's now he's tired. Now he's tired. Like, really, bro? How many of these can we hold? Two? Three? Four? Okay, four. This. These are all new storages too. I've never seen these before. Any of these ones we're building here. And those are going to be, I believe, half logs. 
This will be firewood. Yeah, we might actually have to swim out and get our uh, get our hands on another gun because Virginia actually took off with mine and is not coming back. It's just not coming back, dude. Miguel, thank you so much for the super chat. You have to specifically to rest and eat. Otherwise, he will always be low on both. Take R care of Kelvin, you savage. Oh, I, I, he can't rest and eat on his own? It's a fucking pet? No, it's, I mean, look, don't worry about it, Kelvin. I'll do, I'll do your job for you, bro. I'll do your job for you and I'll feed you. Fucking rub his feet. We'll, we'll get him food. We'll we'll do everything for him, chat. We'll, we'll even do his job. We'll do his work for him. Poor Kelvin. Game's all about Kelvin now, chat. Screw whatever we need. It's all about Kelvin. We gotta go get a drink, though. about Calvin. Yeah, I gotta uh, I was actually gonna uh fill up these water containers here. These cooking pots. I was gonna fill them all up the way I could boil water. See, it's crazy how much... Everybody has me putting in work for Calvin, right? But then when I need something... There's no leeway. Calvin gets all the leeway, I get none. How does that work, Jet? What, just because he hit his head? That gives... That's, Because he hit his head, I now have to spend the rest of my life caring for him. He ain't nobody to me, chat. 
Like, that's just like finding some random guy in a survival situation and be like, you know what? You're my responsibility for the rest of it. Like, no. So you're telling me in an apocalypse situation, you guys are just going to see some random dude who hit his head and in your brain, you're going to go, you know what? You're my responsibility from now on. No, all of us are going to keep it moving. We got our own shit to worry about. Kelvin over here getting special treatment. It's not, it's not fair and impartial, chat. I mean, I guess I did, you know, I did save him at the start, so I guess I, I did claim responsibility. But I thought it was just, I mean, he's doing a good job. Look, he's grabbing them sticks, man. He does something about rocks. Kelvin just doesn't like getting rocks, I guess. He's at least, well, listen, I mean, I'm pretty sure you, a lot of you guys in chat got some co-workers, right? You're telling me, <laughs> you're telling me you're putting it all on the line for some of your co-workers? I don't see it, chat. I'm calling bullshit. I'm pretty sure there's some of your co-workers just because you, you, <laughs> you would go extra Calvin status. You know, oh man, I don't think you hit your head hard enough, dude. Let me, let me help you out real quick. <laughs> Let me help you out real quick, dude. Okay, so we got skin pouches now. Now, do the skull stack? Is it just one? Yeah, it's just one. That's dumb. Actually, there is one more item we haven't built yet, which is, I believe, skull and stick, right? Get the advanced club. Oh, and rope. So we got ourselves a new weapon. <clears throat> Actually don't have any. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so now we can store our firewood on that. This game really does have you out here doing like real like like chores almost guys like like things you would have to do to survive in real life in a situation like this but it's so immersive that it doesn't feel like 
I don't know. It, it's like grind. You know, like this game has grind, but I don't know. The grind feels so weird because it's like things I would have to just do on a day to day. Like realistically, in the apocalypse, you're not or in or in a survival situation, you don't have to go mine. 10,000 metal ores. You know what I mean? Like, that's just unrealistic. It's not true to life. But yeah, you're gonna have to chop firewood. You know, you're gonna have to just do like this, like simple mundane tasks like this. And it just, I don't know, feels more true to life and it's easier to do without it feeling super, super grindy. I don't know. Maybe it's exactly the same. And I'm just being biased, but I definitely prefer this. So we're gonna do. Uh, hmm. We need to make a compound. We'll start off something small like this. Zachary with the super chat. Thank you so much, man. How you doing? I mean, I, I feel like I could very well be biased, but at the same time, like, this shit feels so much better than, like, grind, like, cutting wood and shit like that in Ark. I don't know. This just feels, it feels a lot better. I could, I could do it. No problem. It doesn't, it doesn't hurt my soul the same. All right. So did we fill those boat? No, we still got a little bit more that we could stuff over there. Does anybody else feel the same way or is it just me? Am I... It's like the amounts, you know, the the numbers. Like, let me see the W's in chat. If you could easily play a game like this, like hands down play, but you can't play a game like Ark or like, uh, like Conan, like any of those like really, really grindy survival games. Let me see the W's in the chat. Okay, so there's a lot of people. Oh, I left my uh, little thing over here, too. Get very hungry. So we can get 28 of these on this sled. So two trips. And we'll have enough to do our fireplace. back for that. Oh, there's one. No, yeah, I'm not comparing the games like saying this game is better than Ark. I mean, Ark in, in this game are, are, are... I'm saying the grind. Like, that's what I'm comparing. I'm saying I prefer the grind in a game like this than the game grind in a game like Ark. Um, it, it, it's just way different. We gotta eat, though. We gotta eat, chat. I have, let me see, can we get a candy bar out of the skin pouch. Really? I just want a skin pouch candy bar. Candy bar. There we go. That's all I was looking for, dude. Gary with the super chat, man. 
Oh, Gary, I'm glad I could be here for you. I'm, I'm really, really glad I could be here for you. Hope you're having a good day, man. I hope everything's going well. Oh, Virginia came back for the night, at least. Yeah, one more load of, of, of rocks and our fireplace is good to go. It won't even be a full load either. Maybe like 10 or so. Okay, what do we need for the door? That was another thing we were trying to check. The door was... Half logs. Okay. Easy enough. I believe you secure it with a stick, right? Are these too big? Let me see. Yep, they're too big. And then this one can become one more shelf. Yeah, I love all the new storages. They're nice. And then we can lock the door with a stick, right? Did I put this on backwards, guys? I don't... Damn, Kevin coming at me like that, bro. <laughs> yeah, I put the damn door on backwards. Here we go. We're safe. Safe. So what we're going to do is uh, my, my idea that I had earlier. Oh, uh, we got to get another pistol. So let's let's do this. No shit. It ain't gonna work, guys. Cause I'm gonna land in the water and then my glider's gonna try to float away. That ain't gonna work.
to land on top of the raft. But then it's still a risk. Like, what if my freaking glider falls into the water? I'll be so pissed. Yeah, we are hungry as hell, thirsty as hell too. Let's go. Let's go top off. God damn, I just come in and beat the fuck out of Virginia? Do your thing. Big ass. Yo, get out of my... Damn it, man. I just built that door last night, guys. I'm gonna have to replace that upper log. Turn this into firewood. Wait, what? Why does that look like a full log now? No, it's not. Three quarter. <sighs> Wait, what? Oh. Okay, hold on. So this has to go on top of this, but it won't let me place it. So I got to redo the damn doorway, don't I? That is... So, Chet, do you got to do a d another door? Like, do I got to completely pull these pieces out and then cut in a new door? Oh, you know what? Or, or can, let me see. Can I do this? No. Yeah, I have to. Of course I do. Look at all this wood wasted, man. I mean, it's firewood, so it is what it is, but still, it's still super annoying. Next time we know, lock our door before we leave. 
We won't run into this issue. They won't be able to just get inside. Okay. So why wouldn't it let me place this log then? Yeah, we definitely need a gate. We definitely need a gate um, to keep these guys off of our base, but... We need more ammo. We need we need a lot of stuff, but it won't let me place the log. A uh, worm sixty four with the super chat. Thank you so much. How you doing today? We got wait. No, this was the. Uh, that's a full size. But yeah, when I come up here, if you guys can see. It doesn't give me the option to place the log. Come on, dude. Really? We'll get it. We'll get it figured out, though. We'll, we'll get the door situation figured out. I'm not going to spend too much time on it right now. But Worm, thank you again, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, we, we got we got a lot of stuff to that we got to build. I, I don't know what's going on with this. I don't know. Maybe if I log out and log back in, if it will repair or whatever. But or if I'm going to end up having to take down the whole freaking whole shebang. Oh, maybe that, maybe that was why. No? Nope, still can't place it. I thought it was because something here was damaged. Something here is damaged, I think. So that's every piece of wall out, right? Yeah, that's the top panel piece. That's structural. Yep, so the whole wall is gone. There's nothing here whatsoever. So I can place one at the top here. But that's it. Well, let me put one at the bottom. Let me see if that log down there is broken. damn base taken apart by the time we get this figured out. 
Maybe... Am I using a... No, I, we're using different logs. I wonder if that guy's going to come back over here. Take the stick holders in a way. Yeah, that's what happens, bro. <laughs> you fucked around and found out. I need verticals there to rep because I can't even place verts that only goes down like that and well, maybe I can do verts but verticals is going to make it so I can't place a door though I don't think Yeah, see, because that's the issue. I can't even get the... I think something's... Yeah, it's just all freaking bugged to hell. Run now? Talking all that shit. Savage, bro. <laughs> oh, Virginia said, hold my beer, dude. I was going to let her go. I was going to let her go. I, I actually was gonna let it go, guys. Yeah, so we're gonna. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to dink around with this. I don't know if I'm gonna reload my save because we haven't done anything. Uh, when did I last save? Before my shit got glitched. When was my last save? Let me see. Yeah, a lot of time has passed, actually. So, we'll, if anything, we'll just have to rip the whole freaking thing down and, and figure something out. But, or we just won't have a door. And we'll build a wall and maybe build, like, another little entranceway. I'm going to try a couple things. I'm going to try to move this stick holder because I feel like this stick holder might be messing it up also. Um, the stick holder could be jacking it up because we built that after the fact. But we got to move all those sticks and shit like that, so... All right, guys, but we're going to be ending this here. Uh, we're going to do, the, like I said in the beginning of the stream. Now, remember, guys, let me get it. 
so we're going to be raiding over. Crane's uh, celebrating his 20K um, anniversary. Uh, tons of giveaway things. Giving away like 150 giveaways or something like that. I know some of you guys were already over there and already won. I know Airborne won. Uh, so we're going to raid over to that. Um, if you guys win the giveaways, remember, let me get it. <laughs> nah, but when you guys get over there, spam the chat. Let them know I, got, I sent you. Um, like I say, he just hit twenty thousand. I'm gonna be over there trying to get my hands on some 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 giveaways. I'm gonna be trying to get myself some giveaways. All right, give him one sec. I got this for you. So uh, the, when the stream ends, it will automatically transfer you guys over there. But um, if not, if you guys, here's the link right here. Because I know sometimes it's a little finicky. So I posted the link right there in chat. You guys can click that, head over, uh, do your thing. But uh, thank you guys again so much for all the love and support. We'll be doing another episode of this for sure. Um, try to get this whole thing situated. Next episode, we're going to do a bit more adventuring once I get the uh, fireplace built. Got to get food, water situation going good, and then uh, we'll go from there. But thank you guys again. I really appreciate all the love and support. Remember, if you win the giveaway, congrats. You actually don't have to give it to me. But if you really don't want what you won, you know, I, I'll, I'll definitely take it. Uh, but uh, thank you guys again. I really, really appreciate all the support you guys have been showing this game. It's freaking amazing. Um, but we'll be back later on tonight uh, doing another stream. I'm going to eat, go relax for a little bit, and then uh, we'll be doing one more stream tonight. So uh, I love you all. If I don't see you guys over at Crane Stream, you have a great rest of your night. For everybody else, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.